Korea's film industry has taken off in recent years and currently ranks as the seventh largest in the world. And I'm sure many people will agree, just as important as the content is, of course, who you're watching with. But more than that is the cinema experience. That's where we're focusing on where those movies are being shown here in Korea. On this week's Industry Insight, our cultural correspondent Park ji reports on the success of the country's multiplexes at home and how they're expanding abroad as well. Four out of five movie theaters in Korea are multiplexes, and of them, more than 40 percent are CJCGB branches, the number one movie theater chain in Korea. CGV opened Korea's very first multiplex in Seoul in 1998. Since then, they have launched a number of innovative features, including the nation's first 3D and 4D screens, as well as Korea's first premium screen called Gold Class in 2001. The cost for this premium seat is three times higher than a normal ticket, but you can enjoy free snacks and beverages, as well as the spacious and comfy sofa where you can relax and enjoy the movie. Another key to this success is the Culture Plex, offering more than movies. There's gourmet popcorn, exhibitions, and performances, giving moviegoers the whole package of cultural pampering. CGV provides better membership benefits compared to other movie chains. There are also a lot of restaurants nearby, and it has a good concession menu. Number two in the field is Lotte Cinema, taking up about 35 percent of the market. It's looking to take its motto of happy memories further with its newest theater at Lotte World Mall in Seoul. It's Asia's largest multiplex with 21 screens, one of which is the world's largest projection screen as recognized by Guinness World Records. It offers premium facilities with a lot of amenities. The interior is modern and clean. But industry insiders agree that the domestic market doesn't have much room for additional growth. About 200 million movie tickets were sold in Korea last year, meaning each person in Korea watched more than four films a year, and that's even higher than the U.S. figure. We can say Korea's movie theater industry has pretty much reached full saturation and is seeing its limit. That's why CGV and Lotte Cinema are focusing on expanding their presence in foreign markets. Since CGV opened its first foreign branch in Shanghai in 2006, it's been expanding aggressively overseas with the same strategy of premium service. It's really about the, the, the movie-going experience, the premium experience of sound, screen, seat, uh, as well as a cultureplex model. Uh, ultimately, those things will work abroad, and that's, what we're, that's absolutely part of our strategy. Lotte Cinema has a similar approach. It started with the Vietnamese market back in 2008. We are the number two movie chain in Vietnam, and we aim to be number one by 2018. By then, we hope to have at least 60 branches in Vietnam and in China, with a goal of raking in some 300 million U.S. dollars in annual revenue. Both CGV and Lotte Cinema say they are focused on China and Southeast Asia for the initial phase of their global investment. But ultimately, they want to expand elsewhere based on things that have been worked for them here in Korea. Both hope that in the coming decades, their branches that spread throughout the world rake in more revenue than those based here in Korea. Park Ji-won, Arirang News.